Hey folks, Todd here with Great Escape Farms. Have you ever wondered how to collect scion wood so you can graft trees? Well, today I am pruning several different trees, but I'm standing in front of a pawpaw tree right now, and I'm gonna show you how to collect scion wood off of this tree. So what I'm gonna do, I'm also doing a video on how to prune the tree. So I'm gonna go ahead and prune it first and just let the branches drop on the ground. And then I will come back to this video and show you how to collect the scion wood for grafting later on. Okay, so this is a prolific, and this is one that I can save the scion wood on. That's something I didn't mention in uh, just a couple of minutes ago, is you have to check and make sure that you don't have trademark or patent issues. So prolific does not. It's been around for a while. It's uh, freely open, and anybody can graft it. So this is one that I'm going to go ahead and take. So I have some wood down here on the ground. I'm going to grab that and go trim it. So let me go set up and do that. Okay, we are back at my table here where I've been working. So I am looking for last year's new growth, which you can almost see the color here. So we're kind of gray right here and then we turn brown. So this is all new growth. And so once I get this cut off, you'll notice there's a little round bulb right here. So actually, let me point out, you have that and that, they're two different. So this one is kind of spiky and that's gonna be leaves. This one right here is going to be a flower. And for scion wood, we're gonna take this off. So we don't want any fruit or flower set. So this one is good to go. And what I am going to do is I have a bag here with the name Pennsylvania Pawpaw. I think I called it something different earlier. It's actually Pennsylvania or I think it's Pennsylvania Golden, and I'm gonna put it into a bag, and then we're gonna get a moist paper towel, and I'll show you that in a sec. So let me go ahead and get the rest of these. I'm gonna trim all the new wood off of this, put it in the bag, and then we'll go get a wet paper towel and put it in the refrigerator. Okay, I moved the operation inside, so what I'm gonna do, it's not hot, I'm gonna cold water, and I am going to take this out, and I'm gonna squeeze it, Till I get just about no more water out. And then we open the bag up and we put the wet paper towel in. That keeps it humid enough and moist enough that it won't dry out. And now, get a little bit of air out. Now we will put this in the crisper drawer in the refrigerator and we will take it out once the regular pawpaws, the rooted cuttings that we're gonna actually put these on once they are leafing out and this is still dormant. So what we want is the rooting material leafing out, this still dormant, and that's when we will graft it on. So this is scion wood, ready to go.